Hi friends, today we're doing Unit 9 Lesson 13, A History of People in North America. We're going to start by going over the key vocabulary words to appearing in today's reading. Our first word is abandon, to leave somewhere, never to return. Our next word is evidence, information that helps show if something is either true or not true. And our last word is raid, to attack by surprise. We are now going to move into today's reading. Chapter 12, A History of People in North America. Lots of people think that Columbus was the first to arrive in America, but that's not right. There are at least two other groups of people who settled in North America, and both of them got there many years before Christopher Columbus. This is a map of North America. This image shows some of the places the Vikings explored and some of the Vikings who explored. We've got Leif Erikson, Eric the Red, and Golf, if I'm seeing that correct. One group was the Vikings. The Vikings lived in Northern Europe, in Scandinavia. They sailed around a lot, raiding and robbing as they went. The image above shows you some of the places they explored and some of the Vikings who were explorers. In 1982, some Vikings left Iceland and settled in Greenland, which is part of North America. They arrived there about 500 years before Columbus sailed. The Viking settlements on Greenland grew for a while. Archaeologists estimate there were probably 3,000 to 5,000 Viking settlements there at one point. Eventually, however, the Vikings left. Viking settlements in Greenland seem to have been abandoned in the 1400s, not long before the voyage of Columbus. The Vikings also explored lands west of Greenland around the year 1000. The famous explorer, the famous Viking explorer, Leif Erikson, visited a land he and the other Vikings called Vinland. Most experts believe Vinland was somewhere along the coast of Newfoundland in modern-day Canada. There is evidence that some Vikings settled in Newfoundland. In 1960, the ruins of a Viking village were found there. This village may have been part of Vinland. The Vikings definitely got to America before Columbus, so maybe we should say the Vikings were the first Europeans to settle in North America. But before we decide, we need to look at another group that settled in North America. This is a reconstructed Viking structure at Lance Ox Meadows in Canada. Another group to settle in North America was the Native Americans. Although we call these people Native Americans, they did not always live in the Americas. They came to America from Asia. When and how this happened are subjects of much debate. Some historians think the first settlers made their way to North America a little more than 15,000 years ago. Others think the first people came to America many years earlier, perhaps even 40,000 years ago. Some experts think these people came by land at a time when Alaska and Asia were connected by land. Others think they may have traveled along the coast in boats. When the first settlers came to North America is a subject of much debate. This map shows how people today think human beings spread around the earth. The numbers represent years ago. The map above shows how we think human beings spread around the earth. Experts think the first humans lived in Africa about 100,000 years ago. Some humans moved out of Africa and into the Middle East. About 70,000 years ago, a group of humans moved into Southeast Asia. About 15,000 years ago, or possibly earlier, some of these people crossed from Asia to the Americas. It is believed that many people also came to North America by various ship routes. New archaeological discoveries continue to be made every day about early settlers in North America. These discoveries change our understanding of who lived in North America in the past. You may now move on to Unit 9, Lesson 13, Google Form.